Is there a difference between gratefulness and thankfulness? Hi, I'm Karma Spence, the Own Your Awesome in Business and Life Coach, and I'm here on the final leg of my Pay Me What I'm Worth journey. And today I'm going to talk about gratitude, because today's chapter is chapter 10, Gratitude Guidelines. People often use these terms interchangeably, but do they really mean the same thing? I believe that, like all words, there are subtle differences in energy, and I thought I would explore that with you in today's final episode. First, let's start off with some common ground. Definitions from good old Merriam-Webster. According to merriam-webster.com, grateful means feeling or showing thanks to someone for some helpful act. Therefore, gratefulness is specific to a circumstance and a person. Therefore, I'm grateful for my friend helping me move to my new apartment, but I'm not exactly grateful for moving in general, nor for the friend in general. Merriam-Webster.com defines thankful as glad that something happened or not happened, that something or someone exists. Therefore, I'm thankful for my friend's existence as well as the opportunity to move to a nice new home. In other words, gratefulness is in response to a specific act that is helpful to you. Someone holds the door open, helps you pick up papers you've dropped, or approves your loan, that kind of thing. Thankfulness is a bit broader. It includes actions that were not taken, as well as the existence of something or someone. For example, you can be thankful for a roof over your head, food on your table, and the people you love to share it all with. Do you feel the energetic difference? Gratitude is a specific subset of thankfulness. In chapter 10 of Pay Me What I'm Worth, author Soul Dancer walks you through a few exercises that help you explore more deeply what gratitude is and is not. He helps you understand the fine line between sincere thankfulness and its dark counterpart, manipulation. He also provides some suggestions for experiencing gratitude and thankfulness in your daily life. Research has shown that people who are grateful are happier and healthier, therefore becoming more aware and awake to your blessings is important if you want to live a better life. Also, in my experience, I found that gratitude and thankfulness can help in business, can improve finances, can lead to more fulfilling relationships, and so much more. Now I invite you to come explore your worth with me and soul. I'm accepting applications for the Pay Me What I'm Worth group starting in December, which is three payments of $216 paid monthly. Learn more and register today at bit.ly.com forward slash payspence. Together with author of Pay Me What I'm Worth, Soul Dancer, we'll take a 12-week dive into owning your worth and increasing your confidence. Our Pay Me What I'm Worth Masterclass will begin sometime in December. To best meet the schedules of our group members, the first six people who sign up will determine the day of the week and the time that we meet. They will also get special bonuses. Learn more at bit.ly.com forward slash payspence. Remember, not everyone will be accepted into this course you must schedule an exploratory session with me first to determine if you are a good fit for this group at this time. Also, keep in mind that with each successive group, the price may go up. I urge you to lock in this low price now so you can benefit from the combined experience of both me and Soul Dancer at this very reasonable investment. If you're wondering what this 12-week class can do for you? Listen to what previous students have had to say about Soul's Pay Me What I'm Worth Masterclass by following the link below. You'll hear from Anna 
on performance-based contracts, from Elaine about how she increased her confidence in business, and from Stuart, who, although he thought he was already confident, was able to uncover even more confidence. This is Karma Spence, the Own Your Awesome in Business and Life Coach, in this final episode of the Pay Me What I'm Earth journey. 